Hello, I am Ice Beast, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. So, uh, we've, in the last two episodes, we've really managed to turn around what was going on in this game. I really thought that I may have lost it, uh, when my liege started usurping my lands and putting me in prison, and I was not Catholic, and I really had no way of stopping that. Luckily, we made it out without too much pain. We lost, you know, Amin's Rene, Rene. <laughs> but, uh, but otherwise, we uh, seem to have come out pretty okay, and we're sort of back on track to where we want to go in, in this campaign. We still want to get revenge on Nantes, and that's uh, one of our primary goals, and we'll have to fabricate a claim on Nantes to be able to accomplish that. But in the longer picture, our goal is to take over England. That was sort of the, the principal goal of this whole thing. And uh, that's going to be rather difficult. And the main reason that's going to be rather difficult is we wanted to do it via a papal invasion. And that means we'd have to get an invasion CB on this guy, the King of Wessex. Now, of course, this guy is a fake king. He is not an actual king. He's a petty king. And so if I get the invasion CB... I will, uh, if I, if I was able, actually granted the invasion CB and attacked, I would become, I would get the lands, but I would still be a, uh, part of Aquitaine. I would not be my own king, which would suck. So we may have to declare independence from Aquitaine first to accomplish that goal. The next thing, of course, is that we also need, if we're independent, we only need 250 piety to request an invasion. If we're uh, part of, if we're just a part of a, a territory, we need 500 piety. Either way, we don't have enough piety. You'll also notice that our domains is really bad, and that mainly has to do with the fact that our character really sucks. So our main goal right now is to improve our stewardship. That's what we're going to try to do. We're also going to start fabricating claims on. Uh, these counties over here because we want revenge that is our main goal we don't really want this territory we just want to sort of f this guy in the a so to speak so let's start going now that we have i've told you what i want to do and uh hopefully we'll make it i i just want to reiter reiterate again how happy i am that i've managed to pull out of this sort of death spiral that i was in i was really worried that you guys the, you know the handful of you that have really stuck through it and watched me up to this point would be very upset when it, you discovered that my when you discovered that uh, I basically just lost. <laughs> it looked like I didn't know what I was doing. I've clearly made some missteps. This may be one of them, but I'm pretty proud of the fact that I was able to actually pull this back. Okay, we lost that battle. You go home. You guys go over here. Why didn't you do what I told you to do? This might not be actually be enough guys to clear him out. And how much can I raise? Oh, he's already leaving anyways. What a bastard. I mean, part of the problem right now is just this character is just not good. Um, he has just a whole bunch of bad traits, so we're actually going to go on a hunt. Should have been paying attention to that. And we're also going to build... I always pick the, the prestige one here. It's a little bit of a min-max. We're going to build some walls here. Oh, we have enough time to go on one more hunt. We are trying to get the ambitious trait, if you're wondering. That is the whole goal of going on all these hunts, is to become ambitious. Wow, this guy, Suni, really uh, likes to push my buttons. We're also going to probably hold a... Uh, did we become wounded? No. We're going to also probably hold a feast, so we may be able to get just. Because just is another good trait. So is there a feast available? Yep. I believe we can also become temperate from the feast and that is another fantastic trait it gives plus dude stewardship and we would like that stewardship is what governs the demand size so uh, we will send out uh, our marshal 
because it'll make him love like us more. I will spend just enough. I believe this is the option that gives you a stewardship bonus. Oh, the war is actually going well. Um, yes, we will invite everybody to my feast. Once this feast is over, we're actually going to join the crusade to try to become a crusader because that is also a good, a good uh, trait to pick up, and it's really easy to pick up. Welcome all the people that came out to the feast. I'm glad everybody's happy. Um, apparently this guy insulted me by not having any more wine. Oh no, actually he said some nasty stuff about my food. What a bastard. That was the, the perfect amount of food, and you are just a bastard. Everyone had a great time. I didn't get the, uh, the just chain. That's fine. Is this me? That is me. We will raise our boats. These boats are probably going to cost us an arm and a leg, because boats are really, really expensive. But we'll come over here, and then I believe I can still join this crusade right now. Excellent. So now I'm in the crusade. Oh, we gained one stewardship. Fantastic. Our levies are going to reinforce a little faster. Also good. So uh, I think this is actually going pretty well. We should have no problem getting the Crusader trait. Um, I'm going to actually decline becoming his Chancellor right now because he'll probably try to take me off my boat. And I really want to be on this boat so I can get the Crusader trait. I believe we can scum this up pretty easily to get the Crusader trait just by uh, landing out over here and possibly participating in a battle. If we had to participate in a battle, we'll just attach ourselves to the largest army we can find. And all will be well. Let's just look around at what's going on. Burgundy's getting all sorts of screwed up. Looks like Aquitaine is sort of eating up Burgundy. I don't even know what the hell's going on in Lotharingia. I'm guessing a civil war. There's actually two Burgundies here because there has to be a civil war going on between the Duchy of Burgundy and the Kingdom of Burgundy, which is kind of hilarious. Carpathia has eaten up the Byzantine Empire. That is not good. Luckily, Cumania has split off. Are they in a war? Yes, there's an independence war going on, so that's good. That, that will weaken the strength of Carpathia, at least. They are a little bit scary, though, I will, to say the least. Alright, let's see if we can find... Um, where are our allies? Looks like maybe up here? Excellent, there's a giant stack. We will join the giant stack with our meager forces. Alright, where are you going? I want to attach. Um, I want to attach here. I have to wait till we get wherever this army's going to atta attach. So we stand, we still need to, uh, do something excellent. We uh, got the Crusader trait, which gives us two Marshall, and now we're going to just scum it up and go home. And uh, I really don't care if we lose half these ships right now. Excellent. That was not bad at all. We uh, participated in the Crusade. We got uh, the Crusader trait right here. Gives us plus two marshal, which helps out everything. It means we'll get a slightly better levy, because our owner marshal skill isn't as crappy as it was before. Oh, we missed the hunt. But we should be able to have a feast, maybe? Might might not happen quick enough. We may commission a rune stone. I think we will, actually. We'll commission a rune stone. We will have it uh, speak about our, our dear, departed, departed, dear departed father. Sabor, who didn't really do much, but spent most of his life in jail. And and birth me. So that's great, you know. Way to accomplish something. Of course, his best decision was to get me educated by a Catholic. Which was a fantastic decision, because it saved the family. Always gotta save the family. We're making good money. These walls will be done soon. What about Evro? Oh no. Please don't die. Please don't die. 
The one thing I really don't need right now is to die. Excellent. We get a uh, two-year diplomacy and opinion boost, plus 200 prestige, which also gives us an opinion boost. Let's build... Oh, I can upgrade the Castle Town. Can you go to Castle Town 2 here? You are at Castle Town 2. Very interesting. And you can upgrade. I think it'd be better, though, if I build a militia training ground here. Get the troops. And I'm going to build a... No, I'm going to keep... I'm going to keep my, uh, my monies. Need it. You always need a, you know, a nice nest egg. Can I build a retinue yet? Not quite. That's one of our next goals, is to build a retinue. We'll go up to speed four. Not a lot's happening right now. I am not, I didn't die. That is fantastic news. Fantastic news there that I didn't die. Still making good money. Oh, I need to be paying attention to uh, events or uh, intrigue things that I can do. So let us pause it right here, right here. Excellent. We will go on a grand hunt. Why can't I go on a grand hunt? There it is. Why can't I go on a grand hunt? I'm not at peace because I'm in the war. Well, that's uh, something good to know. So since we can't do that, let's find is there anybody we can kill off. No, we won't gain anything by killing anybody off. That is too bad. We do have some people with claimants on titles. I didn't realize that the Byzantine Empire was so weak. Um, I mean, it's still pretty strong, but Carpathia is pushed into the Byzantines. It looks like... They're attacking for Antioch, which I believe is over here. Antioch? Um, not exactly sure where Antioch is. Let's just pause real quick while I find this. Um, I should be able to just go to Digger Duchies. Yeah, it's right here. So they're attacking for this. Well, they've lost pretty much all of this. That is uh, bad for them. We excellent. The wope, the the wope, the wope likes us more. <laughs> My English speaking ability is, continues to go down. So it turns out that we may have to end up using. I'm going to increase our heavy infantry. Oh, we won! Fantastic. Uh, we may have to end up increasing our. Um, we may have to be, end up using the Holy War CB to take stuff here because I don't think it's going to be very easy to get an invasion CB uh, on this tiny land. But let us continue. Excellent, I got some more money. That's fantastic. We're going to upgrade to Castletown 2 and Evro. My wife is pregnant. Also fantastic. We need a child. We need to you know, put a baby in the baby maker. Interesting. So we're getting better here. It'd still be good to have better stewardship. Which we're hoping to get via Ambitious. Rather than you know, maybe... Is arbitrary the opposite of... No, uh, content is the opposite of ambitious, I believe. Let's go on a grand hunt. I will find the white stag. Wow, this guy... Pretty much every time I go on a hunt, this guy uh, pisses me off. We don't want to take any of these as far as I know. So we will hopefully don't get wounded. Wow, we got pretty much every pop-up you can get. So, the Hounds of Cytodom, excellent. We get a nice little bonus. Um, we don't want to become Craven, so we're going to take a chance of getting wounded. Are we wounded? Okay, we're not wounded. We uh, don't want to be Roth, I don't think. Roth does give me a bonus to Marshall, and I could take a penalty to Diplomacy. Which of these is... Oh, this is giving me a plus two to Diplomacy, though, for two years. Maybe I don't want to take a penalty to diplomacy. I don't really want to get maimed, though. 
I, don't really, I mean, yeah, that's a nice thing to have, but... F it, we'll take Roth. That will help our, get our Marshal up, which will really help uh, our levies. And I will end it myself, which will lower intrigue even worse. That should end that hunt. Excellent, we get more events on the same hunt. The hunt is over, and we will go on another hunt. Jesus Christ, literally every time. Did we get like another million things? We already have Roth, so we'll just gain the prestige again. We will send out uh, this guy to get 20 prestige and make him look like, a be like, like us better. And we will take the uh, 5 prestige there. Wow. Suni, man. Suni, you gotta calm your ass down. Really, seriously. You are, uh, having some problems. Oh, somebody got imprisoned. That's interesting. So we need a new... new spymaster. Which I think, uh, oh, she's possessed. That's probably not the best person to have as a spymaster. Eh, maybe it doesn't matter. Are you... I don't really like that you're ambitious, though. I was gonna ask if you're zealous. Because I get Converter. But we'll take Ulfur. And he will study technology. In now. Carpathian Constantinople. Fantastic. And we're off to the races. Oh yes, we want to go. Oh no, somebody dislikes me. Oh, like he killed my spy master. That's too bad. Or he imprisoned him. I'll take them back for, for 10 Gs. Are you a better Spymaster? Person who just came back? Apparently not. Let's hold a feast. That's what I wanted to do. Before I completely forget about what I'm trying to do here. Get everyone together. We'll all, we'll all have a good time. So spend enough to satisfy everybody's hunger. I still think you can get temperate that way. I may just be uh, smoking the weed. Everybody showed up this time. Wow, you really hate me. Let's just see if we have any non... So this is the first vassal who doesn't like me. And is not Catholic. Are you zealous? You are zealous. Might have to kill you off. I'm gonna kill off Gandalfur. That means that a uh, papal. I'll get a new. Oh, he's gonna die at my banquet. We're gonna kill him off at the banquet, everybody. Didn't get any fancy things from that. That's okay. A daughter was born. Daughter. What should we call our daughter? How about not a boy? No, that's okay. I'm not that mean. We'll call her... Hmm... Uh... Madonna. Madonna. I don't really like Madonna as, an, as a singer. Let's call her Donna. Alright, so we have a daughter named Donna. She's our heir. It's not gonna help anything. Because that actually will make people hate us a little bit more. Apparently, uh, we failed to kill this guy. Now he wants me to come become Chancellor. I will say yes. This time, hopefully I don't get killed, you know, fabricating claims or something like that. So, uh, we're going to see if we kill this person off, and then we're going to call it there, I think. Oh, now he knows that I'm trying to kill him. I believe that he's going to give me dishonorable. So, uh, let's look at our vassals. Yeah, people don't like me because my domain is too big. But I'm not dishonorable, apparently. Interesting. Apparently I'm trying to uh, make people like our liege better. Come on, let's kill that, that bastard off. 
Yes, apparently everybody already knows that I'm trying to, uh, to kill this bastard. Come on. We can do it. It's not that hard. Excellent. He died. And with that, we are going to call this episode here. So, we, uh, it wasn't the most action-packed episode, but we did get ourselves involved in a crusade. And got some good traits, and we're trying to make ourselves a better person, even though we just murdered somebody. But I thank everybody for watching, and I hope you guys will watch the next episode. So once again, thank you, and good night.